the LG V20 has come with a great specs. It runs with Android 7 Nougat and has a screen size of 5.7 inches, screen resolution of Quad HD and has the CPU Snapdragon 820 which is quite the best uh, processor of last year among Snapdragon and has 4 GB RAM and a storage of 64 gigabyte and battery life of 3.2 milliampere looking on the specs we can see clearly this is the correct specs of 2016 flagship on paper it's amazing and can handle any game well what really matters is the real life performance let's put this into action let's see how it does on gaming so let's get started to to know about the gaming quality or the performance of this device I'm going to use a high-ended game and I prefer let's use asphalt 8 yes it's modded because I don't like uh, I prefer I, I prefer racing rather than you know climbing the ladders into higher levels I just need to get the experience of gaming so let's get started the loading was extremely fast I used to play this game on my LG G3 and it used to take something like 4 or 5 minutes to get into the game and now it was just like in seconds and the first step is great I don't know if you guys can hear the music or get the feel of the music it's really amazing the quality of sound is great so let's get started by okay new 11 first uh, finish first we're riding 3 cars in one race and one part in I guess we'll go do a classic match D class competition, triple trials what are the classic matches? tax seasons, I don't need tax seasons uh, play yeah. I need class Go start I just have Yeah, this would do I haven't seen any lag by now What? Let's start the match As you know it's modded so I don't care or any sh anything about the money the Quad HD resolution is doing its best as you know the am not as great as the AMOLED display in Samsung but something far better than the IPS uh, far better than the normal IPS display it's crisp and not dull as other uh, IPS displays quite have a great saturation and yeah it's great uh, it's giving a great experience Ooh. it's extra smooth and yeah just because of that it's really hard to control let's see what's ha gonna happen extreme performance I have to say extreme performance no heating nothing and uh, the quality of gaming is awesome, it's flawless, smooth. Out, out, get the hell out of it. Oh my god. You might be thinking why I'm driving so recklessly. Yes, I'm, I'm a bad driver. And uh, second of all, when you have a kind of lag, you can you get time to decide left or right what to do. This is like extremely smooth and just uh, if it was my G3, I could have seen a small lag and I could have seen that car coming ahead and I could have tilted it just in time. But this is like extremely smooth that everything happens in a fraction of seconds. So I don't have to go very slow. 
और कैटर लाग ही दिवाई ओह माय गॉड सीरियसली I'm showing you this not to show that I'm a, I'm a racer or something. As you can see, it's a horrible match. I lost, but still, LG V20 have won the performance. Speaking of performance, it's great, awesome. And the, uh, as you can see, I can't show you the resolution actually. This video. Would be In the first test, I have to say, flawless and although it's a metal body, it does not heat at all and sound, speaking about the speakers, it's uh, uh, back, it's front firing speakers or fire, it's placed at the bottom and uh, when you hold in the uh, regular manner to control the accelerometer your hand covers the speaker a bit so that's just a bit disturbing although if you don't cover the sound clarity is awesome and uh, as i was mentioned ago it has a great saturation color balance and uh, a great gaming experience i have to say that controlling also smooth but as you have, as you have seen the video i lost that tragically just because it's it's great if you are a pro in this game this is what you need and uh, speaking about that gameplay that was the first game i have played in this game so don't don't blame me for my bad driving so speaking of the space this beast got 64 gb in build and you still have an sd card slot I guess that's more than enough for almost any gamer 64 GB and if you are you can upgrade to 2 TB SD card and that's so there's no botheration about uh, gaming and speaking about battery life this is amazing you can see a wonderful optimization done by uh, some uh, LG here it has got 3200 milliamp battery and it does its job very great and uh, yeah you can game for uh, hours uh, with the uh, with the with one time charging and still if you want uh, further gaming you have the option to use a second battery like you can just remove the battery and place another one and continue playing and that's great because you have a removable back lg is doing this greatly because he, they are the last ones i guess to hold on this ba removable back feature uh, or maybe they destroyed it in the lg g6 so thanks for watching if you have any further uh, ideas or doubts about lg g lg v20 or any recommendations about further videos please help me and i would like to get your reviews thanks for watching subscribe for more like to appreciate me thank you